Hello everyone, this is the Rocker 57 here. I'm doing a little tutorial or just a little bit of a bug fix for Planet Side 2, the launcher. Now, it had a little problem for me where I run it and the first problem was it was just a black screen. It just went totally black and I couldn't do anything. And then the second error I got was this thing. It just says error and it has all this random crap that I don't understand. So, yeah, I hit close, I just screwed around with it, and I finally figured out the solution, and I hope this will help you. Now, this this works for both this error right here, and also for the one where it's just a black screen, a black launcher window. It's the same size and everything, it's just, it's black. Now, you close this, and you can go over and get into, if you have Windows 8, Network and Sharing Center. If you don't have Windows 8, you're going to have to go to Control Panel, so you can go through Screen Resolutions, you can go through Personalize, you can go through... No, it's just these two things. Sorry. <laughs> Click one of those things, go to Control Panel, Network and Internet, Network and Sharing Center, just Control Panel, Network and Internet, Network and Sharing Center, Then you want to click on whatever Wi-Fi connection you have, click on the connection name here, or go to Change Adapter Settings. I'm going to go ahead, click Change Adapter Settings, go to the one that you're using. I have Bluetooth, Ethernet, which I don't have plugged in, just the Wi-Fi. So right-click, Properties, scroll down, I'm going to click Internet Protocol Version 4, TCP slash IPv4, Properties, right there. And then the DNS server, right here, this is what you need to change. Now, mine was set to something that I knew would crash it because that was my original one. Now, I'm going to set mine to just the Google DNS servers of 8.8.8.8, .8 I know, very complicated, and 8.8, .8, no, 8.8.4.4, also very complicated. So, just set it to those two DNS servers right there, and then hit OK, close it, close this, close that. Now, if you just, oopsies, <laughs> if you close that, and you just go to games, or whatever you have your game in, and then just run Planet Side 2. Oop, my background just changed. It should work if you just have that error. But if you have the black screen, you will then move on to that error I just received. Now, if that's a little confusing, if you got the black screen error and you change your DNS server and you launch it, you'll get the error I got before. But if you had that error and then just change your DNS server, you'll go to the launcher and it works but what you gotta do and I, what I always recommend after changing a DNS server or changing anything internet related is just go ahead and disconnect from your internet right there and maybe even connect to somewhere else but I just connect right back connect and it should be good make sure it's good and then you can just go ahead and it should work if you were getting that error before I don't know what just happened to my computer. It is throwing a fit. My screen is blue. Okay, cyan. I don't know what has happened. Task manager, thank you for saving me. I don't know what you did though. Alright, sorry about that. So, you should just be able to open up Steam. No. Open up Steam. Hit play close it. Oh, yeah, you're you're a lot of help. You're a little late there. <laughs> and you should just be able to hit play, run the game just fine. No no problems. Now I'll cut back to you when I'm in once I'm in game and you can see this in action and actually working again. As you can see, we're here at the loading screen. My character is taking a little bit of time to load, but you just go ahead and click play or not. Go ahead, open this up. Just go ahead and click play. You shouldn't have any problems here, but if you do, just leave a comment down below and I'll see if I can help you with it. But as always, this is the Rocker 57 and I am not getting off yet. I'm going to show you it fully loaded. So I'm just going to stop recording here for a second and then re-record once I'm there and I'll show you. Alright, as you can see, back in game here and it should just work perfectly fine. I'm just going to go in here and make sure it's working show you that it is working indeed perfectly now 
I'm just gonna walk out here as you can see. No problems, no trouble. Not a single issue. You should just be able to do everything just as you would as if it never happened. <laughs> 